Hi, welcome to Marshall U. I'm Sean Hill, and in this video, I want to take you through one of my favorite 20-minute bag warm-ups. Okay guys, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit that bell notification icon so that you get notified when all the new videos get released. Also, if you end up liking this warm-up routine, go ahead and kick, punch, smack, smash, karate chop, taekwondo chop, that like button, it really helps out the channel. Also, for this particular warm-up routine, I do recommend that you use a target, such as this freestanding kick bag that I have here, or maybe a hanging heavy bag, such as a Muay Thai style heavy bag, so you can emulate kicking low to your opponent's body. I also recommend using some sort of hand protection like these bag gloves, mostly to protect your skin against the material of the heavy bags. Anyone who's worked with a heavy bag for a while knows that if you punch them or kick them without any kind of protection on for a while, your skin tends to rub off. The material is pretty rough and then you get a raw spot or maybe even start to bleed and that's gross and no one wants it. So I also recommend using instep guards or some sort of foot protection on your feet to prevent the same thing from happening to your insteps as your kick especially if we get lazy in our kicks and our feet rub on the material, your skin's gonna come right off. And this is especially gross if you're sharing equipment with other people in the same dojo or dojang. It's just gross and nobody wants that. Gloves are on, instep guards are on, we're ready to go. When you hear the bell, we're gonna start with some joint mobility. Upper body first. I want you to just start with rolling your shoulders, rolling back. Now roll them forward. Okay, arms out and let's circle, circle forward. It's important to get, get our joints ready for the impact of the striking. And slow down, go back. Good, now I want you to take your arms and basically go back and forth, rotating. Nice, now we're gonna transition to lower body. I want you to start with hip rotations, pick a direction. Slow that down, let's go the other way. Nice wide circles. Good, slow that down, pick one leg up and I want you to rotate the shin around. Pick a direction, it doesn't have to be the same way I'm going. And then stop, go the other way. And get that ankle, rotate it. And go the other way. Good, switch legs and rotate that shin around. Other way. And let's get that ankle. And other way. All right, the bell is the sound of action. All right, the first thing we're gonna do, we're just gonna work our jab. So remember, this is light. We're not trying to go kill the bag. This is a warm up, so we're gonna just Tap the bag, return to guard, and I want you to move around the bag. So I like to move, tap, move, tap. Move. And then switch your feet, and let's work the other side. And then I like to play, and I like to move into the jab. So I'm slicing into the jab. So I'm going to use the same arm. Switch. Good. That is the sound of the first kick. So now we're going to do a basic kick just to get our kick warmed up. I'll come over here. We're going to do push kick. So I want you to alternate Push kick with one leg, push kick with the other. Just kind of 
gonna skip that. next punch and this is going to be a double jab so I kind of like the double jab set you up for a good cross so you're just going to tap twice just like that move same thing switch it up Then I like to move into it. Switch. All right, now we're going to switch our kick up. We're going to do snap kicks, so we're going to jab the ball of our foot into the bag. Remember, you're not trying to kill the bag, this is still a warm-up. So just jab it, switch legs, jab it, move around if you want. All right, next thing, classic, jab cross. Okay, let's move the bag back. So you're just gonna jab, and then cross. Classic, classic, you see? Jab cross, work around the bag. And then switch, do the other side. You wanna be ambidextrous. This is good at both sides. Next kick, we're gonna do side kick. Okay, we're gonna get our hips warmed up. So this is more about technique, not power. So just come up, jab it out, switch your legs. Come up, jab it out. Don't try to knock the bag over. As you get warmed up, you find it's easier and easier to go higher and higher. All right, next punch, double jab cross. Okay, so we're here, jab, jab, cross. Okay, just like that. Just play with it, have fun, work around 
bag. Don't forget to switch arms for your, your lead jab. Roundhouse, okay? So from here, we're gonna, we did side kick before, we're gonna come up. Roundhouse. Nice and light. Don't worry about technique. Jab, cross, hook. Classic combination. Jab, cross, hook high, hook. So work that around the bag. I like to alternate almost like every punch. Next kick, we're gonna do double roundhouse. So we're gonna come up roundhouse, roundhouse, drop it, roundhouse, just like that. Jab, cross, hook, body shot. Okay. Jab, cross, hook, get him in the body. Whoa. <sighs> Just like that. Love this combination. Boom, boom. There's something about hitting that low. Okay, remember technique, so don't go crazy with it. We're here just trying to be accurate. Go 
Don't knock the bag over like I did. You want throw a couple of jumping ones in there? <laughs> Try not to knock the bag over. Alright, now we're gonna have a little fun. Fun? <laughs> Jab, cross, we're gonna hook and miss and then do a back fist. Love doing this. So it's jab, cross, throw your hook as if they got out of the way, hook, spin around, bring this foot all the way around, and as you do, you're gonna come through with the back of this. So jab, cross, hook, back of this, just like that. And just play with this. Switch it up. Sometimes I like to add another punch at the end, so. Good, play with that one. Next one is a kick. And if you know my videos, you like, you know, you know that I like to build up to things. So we're gonna do fast kick or skip in. Uh, roundhouse, so we're here. We're going to skip into it. So in Taekwondo is called fast kick. We're skipping roundhouse. This one's cool because you can play with your speed. You can go nice and slow. Speed it up. Play with your footwork a little bit. So switch feet, come in. All right, next combination is a jab cross. This is why I recommend the Muay Thai bag or one of these. We're gonna do jab, cross, and we're gonna take advantage of this extension here, and we're gonna do a roundhouse. Jab, cross. Low to the bottom. Okay. Then we're gonna switch. Nice. Next one is skipping side kick. So we're gonna be here, quick. We're gonna skip in, side kick, really fast. Switch your feet, skip in, side kick. So we wanna get your opponent off you. Here. Same thing, play with your footwork. All right, next round is freestyle punching, okay? So that means anything goes on the bag. So I just want you to work around the bag, punch at will.
All right, last round, this is the finale. Continuous up balls, okay? Up balls are front roundhouse. You're right by the target. Pick your leg up. Hit the top. We're gonna go to 10 on each side. That is the sound of, you are done. That was 20 minutes of warming up. Now you're ready for your real heavy duty training. So get a towel, wipe the sweat off, rehydrate, make sure you rehydrate with some electrolytes. And subscribe to the channel, like the video if you enjoyed this routine, hit the bell notification icon, and above all, Never stop learning, never stop growing, never stop achieving, and never stop unleashing your potential. I'll see you in the next video.